recent videos, they've slowed down. Uh, this is from 10-9-2016. 10-9-2016, the Sunday at Anchor Church. to come back home for this this couple with the familiar faces the 12 witnesses the psyop i mean remember my phone only works outside they have to watch me to know when to hijack my phone i live in the middle of nowhere uh, 10 9 2016 the day i stopped going to church I see the moon on the screen. Right hand dog is, is dark right here. So one of the benefits is doing this at night. So you can't see me when I'm yeah, recording. See. This has been going on for quite some time. Well, this yeah. camera I'm using is blurry. That's a good one. Um, there's three more to go. Bear with me. More important ones coming up soon. I think the last one's gonna be the best one. I got this to the last one. Touching the S. Um, Ten minutes. Do anything. I'm starving. Damn it, Silas. Okay. See how they're typing these in. Obviously, I'm not striking the screens. Let's do this again, so you can see. What are you trying to tell me, gang stalkers? It's part of how they send me covert messages. And they egg me on and pretend. I remember one of the symptoms of mental what? illness is thinking that the to government the stalkers. is sending you covert messages through your phone or etc. For what they do. This. Got you bitches on this record. So fuck you. What the fuck are you gonna do about it? You delete it off my phone, I just put it back on my phone. What the fuck are you gonna do about it? What the fuck? What the fuck are you gonna do, man? Pussy ass motherfuckers. Ten nine two thousand sixteen. The hijacking still. I'm still curious what the fuck you pussies are gonna do about it. I'm the top. You're caught cheating, drugging, fuming, gang stalking. Sending me covert messages trying to provoke me. On record, I have people saying that they were told. To provoke me to get me sent to the psych ward. More than one of them. Three. Two of them in one fucking interview at the same time. The fuck are you going to do about it, punk? Oh, punk ass sniveling rats. Ford Foundation pussies. They hide. And their women, their sisters, their children. They all notice. That I'm right. Dad, if he could hit you first, he could stab you to death first, and then what's going to happen to us? If he ever figures out, what's going to happen to us? The same way he outmaneuvers you in sparring is the same way he'll outmaneuver you, kill you, and rape mother. Their women know they are insufficient, and I am a man who has the heart to go against the grain and can beat them. At manly combat, natural combat, true combat. They know this beyond any doubt. And they know that their man is an emasculated, gang-stalking coward without any heart. Without any courage. A yes man. A puppet. A pussy. The only thing more glorious than slaughtering your enemies or beating them at sparring is having them hide and cower after they've drugged and fumed you. Cower like little bitches. It is similar to them not showing up on the battlefield and leaving their wives, friends, and families vulnerable for you to rape, pillage, and murder at your leisure. I had them hide like bitches. Come out and see me in battle!
No, we're scared. Oh, well, well, excuse, excuse. See me, motherfucker. See me.